So in this video, we're going to be learning how to mention other users in posts. So for example, I could say at how code and I could say hello world. If I click post, now it says at how code hello world, but it doesn't actually create a link. So what we're going to do is create a link whenever we see an at symbol in a post. So to do that, whenever we post something, we're going to start on the user's profile page to begin with. Whenever we post something, we want to check if the body contains any at signs. So we're going to run a function called, we'll call it link add or something. And we'll paste it down here. And then up here, what we'll do is we'll create that function. And we need to say just self to make sure that we're getting it from this class. So what we're going to do first, we'll just return the text. And we'll just run this and see nothing should have changed. So you can see nothing changed. So we could use regular expressions to do this, or we could just do something really simple. We could say for each text as word. In other words, for every word in the text, we're going to say if sub str word zero one, which is the first character of the word equals an at sign, then we'll echo that word. And before we can get that to work, we need to say text equals explode on spaces text to convert it to an array. And down here, when we return it, we want to convert it back into a string. So we'll say implode text on spaces. So there, everything we everything works the way it should. Everything's back to normal. But we have at how code printed out at the top. So we're echoing that word. So what we want to do is we will say new string is an empty string. For every word in that string is we will say string dot equals word to append on the new word. And we'll say append on a space at the end of that. And we need to change that to new string actually. And what we want to do now is we will put this in an else statement. And then otherwise what we'll do is we'll say new string dot equals word, just like before. But what we'll do is we'll also append on a link to the user's profile that was referenced. And then what we'll do is we will say echo new string. So here you can see the new string is echoed and this new string has our link in it. But that link won't work when we run it through the rest of our page because the rest of our page uses HTML special chars to prevent against cross-site scripting and things like that. So what we want to do is when we return, we want to return new string. And we don't need to implode it anymore because it already is a string. So you can see there's our link and it hasn't actually printed out the link, it's just printed out the HTML. And that's because of HTML special chars. So what we want to do is remove the HTML special chars from the outside and we want to run it on each individual word. So here we want to just say HTML special chars, just like that. And what we'll do is we'll run this now and see what happens. And it should work fine. So now you can see if I scroll down, the old hello world in bold doesn't work. But if I scroll up, our link that we generated that points to how code's profile page works exactly as we would hope. Then what we're going to do is we're going to actually point it to their profile. So we'll say profile.php equals. And the username is going to be equal to a string, which is going to be substring word and we want to start on the first character and skip it and get all the other characters so we're leaving out the at sign oops it's sub str you can see we have the link how code now and if i click on it it takes us to how code's profile page and then again because we have the post form up we can't actually use it if i click that and click post you see it says incorrect user but whenever we finish the actual design we're going to be deleting this sort of thing to make sure that it actually looks more like a social network and it doesn't confuse users into thinking they can post on other people's pages so the next thing we would have to do is create a notification system and the notification system would be how you would tell someone that they've been mentioned in a post that's a very complicated system and we're going to be doing that in a later part of this series but that's it for this video don't forget to like comment favor and subscribe don't forget to follow us on facebook twitter and reddit and i'll see you next time